Hey everyone, this is Robert and Jessica with Exploring the Local Life. <laughs> Today we were going to talk about what it is like to be in a 26 foot travel trailer 24 7. 24 7. Together. 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 Forever and ever too. really like all right first first you have to understand Robert and I really do uh, not only love each other but we actually like each other too yeah yeah true we've been together a long time started off as friends got married and here we are today people say life is short life is long especially if you're married to the wrong person so what is it really like um, I guess I would describe it as think of your, like, your two-week vacation where you all been in a hotel room together 24 7 and it's like the last day right except, the last day you're yeah. a little bit like you know except the day never ends it just goes on and on yeah all those little things that are mega quirky things that annoy you because it's not like you get a break when you go to work break because when work is at home if you're not, or if you're not going to work at all. And if you're traveling on a budget, then you can't just get in the truck and take off because you'll start getting a proposal. Where are you? I'm right outside the front door. What? What? Don't you want, don't you want to be with me? Right, I really like being with Robert 24 seven. Like I love the fact that we are here for six months uh, and he's not going to work and he's with me all the time. It's so wonderful. I love it. Although I have noticed that I hate it when he shakes things up. Anything in a container that he shakes, it gets... Some things require shaking as we have discussed in the past. So all those, oh again, like I was saying, all those weird quirky things really start getting annoying. And if you do get into an argument, there really isn't like, you can't really go to another room. Yeah, she, uh, yeah. There's really nowhere there to go. There is a toilet. You can say, I gotta go to, I gotta go drop a deuce. Whether or not you have to. Or you can go outside and stuff. But still, you, you don't really, there's not really, really where to go. I mean. No, no, you can't go outside because then she thinks I'm angry with her. Because you are. <laughs> You're going to leave me? <sighs> yeah. So, uh, it's kind of really a test of your relationship, I think. Living in a space like this. Um, so I would say if you don't have a strong relationship to begin with, I would not recommend. I do not recommend sealing yourself in a little tin. Oh yeah, yeah. It's, it's like people say, oh, well, maybe if we have a baby, we'll grow closer together. Now get a dog. No, don't do things to add a little uh, stress. A bit of stress a to your. Sometimes, but it's great. It's not really any more stressful. It's just that the things that do that you do notice. Are just it's just amplified the noise is amplified uh the mess is amplified if somebody leaves their shoes out all the time yeah even though you have less stuff it's amplified. in a concentrated area think 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 concentrate the kids uh, are playing it sounds like there is death and screaming happening but they're having a great time they're having a great time until of course somebody inevitably does start crying yeah but it's not again it's not any different really than being in the house it's just all concentrated condensed, condensed in a she little says condensed. Time. i'm saying concentrate concentrated same same thing same thing Right, so it can really suck, and the days that um, that it's raining. Actually, the rainy days are pretty nice because it's nice, calming, and soothing. And then nobody can go outside to play or be outside yeah. at all. So yeah, being together 24/7. Should my turn to say something about that? Oh, I thought you were having your turn. <laughs> Two. Yeah, to, uh, being together 24/7 is uh, great. very convincing. I miss my job so. So what do you think of living 24-7? I mean you're in the same spot uh, in the travel trailer you have your little room. It's good. What are the negatives? What don't you like about it other than travel days? My bedroom is so incredibly small. Wish it was a little bigger? Um, I wish it was not your size. A I taller wish, room. Yeah. I wish it was also in the, up on the top. Okay. I, I can understand that. And the audience is a little wider than mine. No, same width, same width. But yeah, it definitely has a greater volume. <coughs> space, a volume of space. Um, I really did yak. Okay. What do you think of hanging out with Daddy and Mommy all the time? 
good. Good sometimes and sometimes <laughs> annoying. Yeah, I know. Mommy and Daddy can be really annoying. Yeah, and sometimes we miss uh, date nights. Mommy and Daddy do. Oh, yeah. Nadia, what do you think of living 24-7 all day long in a travel trailer? What are your thoughts? Nadia says. Do you enjoy being with mom and dad? Yes. She said yay. I mean yes. Yeah. So we're going to be doing this for a while longer. Are you enjoying this trip seeing Gettysburg and the waterfalls that we go see in the different areas? Yeah. Washington, D.C. was pretty cool? Mm-hmm. I love it. So overall, there's some icky parts. Yes. But the wonderful parts, like, I mean this right here, <laughs> uh, outweigh it all. And having the opportunity to grow together. And Mr. And jo uh, Mr. Job Fernando. Guys, I don't think the fire's in the video because I can barely see it. It's okay. <laughs> so the opportunity to be together and to grow together and experience all these different things that we wouldn't have normally done. So yeah, that's that's um, what it's like to live 24-7 in a travel trailer. We love it, but we miss some things. Uh, there's good days, and then there's a horrible, horrible days. And then there's amazingly amazing days. And yeah. then there's sweet moments, even in some of the really crappy days. Yeah. So? So like the day where I randomly hugged you. Yeah, that's a great thing. Yeah, it was close to this day also. But it's like, Mom, I want to hug you. And we get to do more campfires uh, like this than we ever had before. Um, that I like all being and... Alright folks, thanks for watching and uh, catch us later uh, on the next episode. Yeah, let, let us know what you think. Bye! Yeah. Bye! Bye. Bye.